it, it harkens me back to uh, our early days in Dallas, you know, where you, you, you could see it. You started feeling like, hey, man, we got a chance of doing something, man. It, 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 you know, as I told them, the last two weeks ago, you played the only undefeated team down to the wire. Last week, you beat the champions. So the, the physical talent, we know it's there. The thing that's going to separate the good from the great and the others from the champion is if you have the ability to make a commitment, one man to the other. Each and every time I step on this field, I will get my job done. That's what makes this game the greatest game in the world. You know, it's unlike basketball, baseball, or, or, or golf, basketball to run, go from one rim to the other by himself. And baseball, the guy sits at home, played all by himself. Golf, you see a guy dropping that put up. In this game, you don't do anything all by yourself. I mean, you don't do anything. And so it's imperative that we all have an understanding in order to get to where we want to be, where we leave our mark as a team, that we make that commitment. It was the common thread woven through all the championship teams that I've been on. And I've been on quite a few championship teams on all levels. The common thread was a commitment made, one man to the other, that each man is for the other, and I will get my job done. And that'll take them from being a part of, or being, being like the rest of the guys in the league to being the champion of the league. It's not a physical thing. It's not a shoulders down thing. It's a shoulders up. It's a commitment made, and, and, and that makes the difference. And did, uh, I mean, you go back a long way with Rob Jasinski yes. and with North Turner. No, did, they, no. did they ask you to come here and do this? Uh, yeah, you know, I, Russell, Maryland, I got quite a few people around here that we have history with. And, and man, it's one thing to say I got history with these hurt people. It's another thing to say my history has been championships with these people. Let me say that. My history has been championships with these people. You know, Chud and, and Russell in college and then Norv and Russell and those guys in the pros, you know. So wherever we've gone, Wherever we've had a chance to make a commitment with each other, we made those commitments and, and ended up in a, in a champion, and ended up as champions. And, and, and these guys, they're doing their job. I said it when they, when they hired these guys. I said, what? Okay. This is a great direction. You know, Ray Horton on duty. All of these guys. I would hate to have to go out on this practice field every day playing this kind of a game, a game that is this difficult to play, and, and I'm being led by someone that knows, that knows, knows not a champion on any level. On, that's hard, man. How can you take me? How can you tell me what you do not know? How can you take me where you did not go? And so these guys have all gone to championships. So all it takes is these guys to make a commitment to each other and to listen to the guidance, and they too can be there. And I told him, I said, man, I know what football means in Dallas. That's what football means in Cleveland. <laughs> you know, these people here love football. If you give them a championship, oh my God, you, 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 you I, I said you'll change your life's path in the life path of your kids. Because they'll be remembered just like they'll be talking, boy, your dad brought a championship. We love you, son. They'll, they'll love everybody. It comes out of your loins because you <laughs> brought a championship to Cleveland. That's, that's just how great the game is, and especially that's how great the fans here in Cleveland. Oh my God, it'll be, it'll be something. And, and, and a lot of times you get a lot of young talent, and they need to they need to hear what it takes and understand. I know you fought through some probably some tough situations to get here because I had to fall through a tough situation in my upbringing. And when you fight through such situations, like, man, I do, I'm doing everything on my own. Where was everybody when I was broken, hungry in Fort Lauderdale? So you take that mentality and you bring it to the league. But if you come in the league with that mentality, you won't survive long and you won't have real success. You know, it was your great, it was the greatest asset. Now it becomes your greatest liability. And you have to drop that and start saying, man. And I said to him, I've been around them. I've seen football teams 
football organizations, they never win championships. Never do. Only football families win championships. Could you tell that you had